what are you doing right now that it seems like, you know, attracting, retaining talent's a challenge? And how is this challenge different for, you know, as we talked about the micro and small businesses, those mom and pops? Um, you know, I think the, the industry's kind of got two segments now. You've got the corporate practices and the larger practices, but there's still those solo vets out there, one or two vet practices that are trying to make their way. So what what are those challenges and, and what, what are you doing to assist practices or, or what are they doing to differentiate themselves to help attract talent? Yeah, the, the exciting part about what we do is that there, there's a lot of rewards to it. So I think it, it pulls a lot of people to, to seek out the industry. But you're right about the, the burnout with the five years. You know, it's, it's not only difficult from losing a, a talent and skill loss for the ta- for the practices but we're also losing some relationships and we know as as important as it is you know you're not just the veterinarian you're the you're the, the family doctor so so we want to keep those relationships preserved and keep people at the practice for a long time 